In order to give their troops a better chance in the dense jungle of Vietnam, the U.S. Army deployed so-called tactical tree crushers. During the Vietnam War in 1967, the U.S. had one of the strongest armies in the world. But tanks and strategic bombers could do little to help the infantry soldiers as they fought their way through dense jungles where enemies lurked everywhere. Searching for a solution, they finally came across the tactical tree crusher. With a height of 21 feet, a weight of 66 tons, and a huge bumper, it could easily run over trees up to three feet thick. The three huge metal wheels helped crush the fallen tree trunks, leaving no cover for the enemy, but also dug into the muddy ground quickly. After a few months, the pioneers returned the 66-ton beast and proposed a series of improvements. 12-pointed wheels, a machine gun turret for self-defense, and claymore mines on the sides of the vehicle. However, the U.S. Army discontinued the project since cheaper alternatives were available. One of the last tree crushers can still be admired today in Mackenzie, Canada.